And the Golden Globe goes to Jean Dujardin, the artist. The star of the award-winning movie The Artist savors his win. But only last year, Jean Dujardin was virtually unknown, apart from in his native France. The 39-year-old actor has quickly earned a name for himself as France's answer to George Clooney, a comparison the actor still hasn't come to terms with. When I was starting out, an agent said to me, you never do movies. Your face is too expressive, too big. It's not my fault, my eyebrows are independent. Jean Dujardin started out as a stand-up comedian over 20 years ago. He then starred in a number of television shows before making the transition to the big screen. After a number of bit roles, Dujardin starred in back-to-back -back hits at the French box office, with the likes of Brice de Nice, Lucky Luke, and the spoof spy film OSS 117. But this success hasn't gone to his head. I know this business is precarious. I know that in five years I could be broke. Lots of things can happen. No one knows. In the end, I trust my gut feeling when choosing my films. This gut feeling led him to take a gamble, a role in a silent black and white film. Seduced by the artist, the American producer Harvey Weinstein helped to raise the film's global profile. Dujardin went to Hollywood to promote the film, specially coached in English for presses and television interviews. Bonjour la France. Yeah, yeah, everyone. What is, do you right? want? An impression? Can you do an impression of our Yeah, sure. Yes. Yeah, that's good. I'm talking about Thank you. Dans la langue de Shakespeare. Four years ago, another French film conquered Hollywood. For her role in La Vie en Rose, Marion Cotillard won both a Golden Globe and an Oscar. An example Jean Dujardin will hope to emulate.